I believe I remember how to do this. But seriously, today I'm going to show you how to cut videos in Premiere Pro. Real quick, I want to say thank you for checking out Video Editing with Tyler White. I'm Tyler White and I've been a video editor for about 8 years. So if you're looking to increase your skills editing video, tap the subscribe button and hit the bell so you don't miss a single video I post. Alright, so for the sake of this tutorial, I've already imported my video into Premiere Pro. But if that's something that you have questions on, I did a video on that before, and I'll go ahead and link that up there in the YouTube cards. You can hop over there, check that video out, and then just head back over to this tutorial and then you can push on. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and hop right into it. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go down here to our razor tool or press C on our keyboard, and that's gonna bring up our razor tool, all right? And then all we're gonna do is just go to the portion in our timeline that we want to split the clip, and then we're just gonna click on it. And that's, pretty simple that's going to split the audio and the video right down the middle but let's do this let's say that we have our audio and video separate as in maybe this top portion is video and this audio down here is maybe your music let's say you want to you want to be able to split both but you can't with the razor tool like this right so what we're going to do is we're just going to hold down shift and that'll split it right down the middle. And that works with, say you have additional footage on the top of this. Okay. What you can do is just, we drag this up top, make an additional layer, all right? We can press C, hold down shift. That's gonna split it all the way down the middle through all three layers, all right? So let's go ahead and back up real quick, all right? Say we wanna just move our footage this way at the front of our timeline. But as you can see, there's a better way where we can make it pop back over to the front. We have to drag this back over to the front if we do that, that way. Let's try it this way. We're gonna hold down Command on Mac, Control on Windows. And all we're gonna do is just gonna drag it forward. And that's gonna pop back into place right there at the beginning of our timeline. Which method worked best for you? Let me know in the comments. I usually go with keyboard shortcuts, but it's different for everyone. That's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you learned something. And if you have a quick sec, if you could drop a like on the video, because every little bit helps, right? And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Also, if you're looking for specific tutorials, drop them down in the comment section below and I'll definitely check them out. Thank you so much for watching again, and I'll see you in the next video.